Hey everybody, this is Dr. Lori Langdon, board certified pediatrician, mom to six and grandmother to two with a quick update reminder. So you guys know how sometimes you'll bring your children into the office and maybe they have a chief complaint of some sort of pain. And in absolute love and adoration, I understand your motivations. You supply the answers to my questions. But sometimes, remember, I'm trying to ask the child. So, for example, if I need to know what the pain feels like or where the pain is located, these things I need for the child to answer once it's developmentally appropriate and they're old enough to answer. So, I know you are well-intentioned when you jump in there and supply me the answers, but please, I want to hear it from them because they're the only one who actually knows exactly what it feels like and exactly where it hurts. Now, for how many days it's been going on, I'm probably going to need you to help. Uh, you know, which day did this start? Can you tell any time of the day that it's worse? Things like that. There are many of these sort of questions I'll need your help with, but when they're very specific about the location or the quality of the pain or the severity, I really need to hear it from the child. That would help us so much. Now, particularly as the children get older and are teens, you will notice that we pediatricians try to talk almost exclusively to them so that we can have the conversation, develop a relationship with them. So particularly then it's very helpful to let them answer. But even with the younger children for certain scenarios, we need to get the answers from the kids. So thanks for your help, but try not to help too much. Thanks.